Hi. Well, my daughter has gotten married, come back, and she's been on her honeymoon, but she still had a few things to resolve with her room, so she's back in town for a couple of days just to take care of that. In the meantime, friends of mine went ahead and gave her a shower at their office. Now, they're totally in another state. Wanted to do something to support her. What we're going to do is I'm making this video so they can see her open up her gifts. We also have a couple of other people who have sent gifts that made it after she was out of town. So we're going to pop this video up and let you see as she opens the gift. And without further ado, I'll be right back after the bumper and we'll see more of Allie. Well, look, there she is. Hello. Wow, where do you want to get started? Uh, why don't I start with the one that's right in front of me? Okay, I'll move some of the other bags out of the way so you can do that. Hey Allie, what my friends did is they got you a couple of presents and they gave you a pounding. And for those of you who don't know, a pounding is when they give you a pound of this and a pound of that. And it's an old southern tradition that's designed to help you get your first kitchen set up. We have oil. Craft Parmesan cheese with a hot pepper trio. That might be neat to try. Spaghetti sauce. Spaghetti sauce. I think I see spaghetti in there too from here. Yeah, yeah on the other side. In the middle of the other side. Here. Aha, hot perfect spaghetti. So yeah, spaghetti sauce and spaghetti. And Parmesan cheese. And Parmesan cheese and pizza crust. Pizza crust, okay. You can use your Parmesan, I bet, on the pizza crust. I bet I can. That's I bet like there's sauce idea. in there. Is there pizza sauce? Uh, whatever this is. Because they're doing it in sets. So, pizza. so you can make yourself a pizza, even if you don't have other cheese. You've got pizza sauce, red pepper, Parmesan, and pizza crust. And then you've got spaghetti and pasta. What else you got? Cake for dessert. Ooh, cake. And muffins for breakfast. Yay! Hummus made easy. Just blend with Bush's garbanzo beans. Cool. I didn't know they did this. That's pretty cool. Heart garbanzo beans. Yay! So you've got garbanzo beans and hummus kit. And frosting for the cake. Oh. So you can have dinner and dessert. I can. Baking soda. Oh, you'll need that. Yeah, I will. All purpose flour. Good deal. And Martha White cornmeal mix. Oh, Southern Staples. Well, that's yeah. cool. That's pretty cool. That's a cool box. Thank you very much. Well, this is a cute bag. I really like it. All right, let's see what's in it. Pancake mix. Yay, they got your number. Oh, they do. They absolutely do. Whatever this is that I can't get a hold of. Lots of sugar. Yay. Did you get sugar in the other one? In the tote? Flour, baking soda. Okay, so no sugar. No sugar in that one. Okay. Another cornmeal mix. Southern oh. staple, honey. Staple's the right word for it. You're going to use a lot of cornmeal mix, though. And syrup. And syrup. <laughs> so pancake syrup, sugar, and cornmeal mix. Thank you very much. This is a neat, looks like a reusable tote that's been insulated. And it is. Oh, that's so cool. You like that? I do like it. The pie crust. Okay. That's got to go with something. I don't know. We'll find out. It, Mashed potato soup mix. Okay. Crackers for the soup. Oyster crackers and soup. Okay. Meat tenderizer. Excellent. Now, did you have any spices? Any meat tenderizer? Nope, none of that. Okay. Now you did. No, I knew how to read it. Cinnamon. Oh, lemon pepper season salt. That sounds nice. Salt and pepper. Sea salt in a grinder. Yeah, it's 
nifty. Very nifty. Very, very nifty. Bacon sandwich. Bacon powder. No baking soda. And more spices. Paprika and Italian seasoning. You like Italian food, so that'll go really well. Whoever got that and I hit the nail on the head with the Italian seasonings. And the key lime, key lime filling. <laughs> <laughs> so one day we'll have cake and the next we'll have key lime pie. That's wonderful. I just cut your head off, sorry. Oh, whoops. So I don't use it very often. And cornstarch. Yay. Yay. Well, thank you so much. Allie, this one didn't get wrapped, so I'm just going to hand okay. it to you all at once there. Oh, a hot pot oven mitt set. I was wishing for this the other day. <laughs> Measuring cups and spoons. That's wonderful. And a cookie scoop. And opener. Awesome. Uh, that'll be good for when the power goes out too since I'm not electric. It will. Absolutely will. And a timer. Wonderful. Oh, that's cool. And pastry brush. Ooh, pastries, turkey basting. Pastries, turkey basting. All sorts of things. Anything I need to put an egg wash on. Oh, there's two baskets here. Oh, that's so cute. good for storage. Absolutely. This is really neat. Thank you so much. Let's see what's in here. What's in this? What she's stepping on is right down here. Hey, Tomlin! He doesn't want to be far from Allie. Good boy, Tomlin. We're going to go back to her opening presents, okay? Okay. Back to the main event. Oh, that's what it's caught on. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Well, I can tell you it's a crock pot. And I really like it, if, and I'd like it more if I could get it out of the bag. How do you know it's a crock pot? Ah, it's, it's a, a crock, crock pot. pot. Okay. One never knows. One never knows. Just be careful. Oh, drinking glasses. Yay. Didn't have any of those. Nope, these are pretty. So no drinking glasses, no seasonings. Did you have flour? No. Cornmeal? No, no. No pizza stuff? Uh, no. And what's one of your favorite foods? Of course pizza. Okay. <laughs> and I already know you like spaghetti. It's Those are not pretty. Like spaghetti. These are pretty. They're tall. Well, thank you so much. I, re I really like everything. That's a really cute card. Thank you so much, you guys are awesome. So you're just hanging out under the table while she gets all of her things open, aren't you? Oh, nope, out you go. <laughs> so back to laying down. <laughs> <laughs>